What's up everybody, so if you haven't heard yet, the Samsung Note 7 is being recalled because it is essentially a hand grenade which can explode when it's being charged. You definitely want to return this to the store ASAP and either get a loaner phone from them or get your money back. And before you do that, one of the things that I always do whenever I return a phone or sell a phone is I do a factory data reset on it. This basically puts the phone back into the state it was when you took it out of the box. and there's two ways to do this. One is from the settings in the phone, but I've read in several places that's not the most complete way to do a reset. The best way to do a reset is from the recovery mode, and the way to access it on phones is a little bit different depending on the device you have, but I'm going to show you how to do it on the Note 7. So right now the device is powered off, and to power it on, you're going to have to do some uh, hand gymnastics here. You're going to hold the power up button, the home button, and then press the power button. So let me go ahead and do that here. And so we'll get some text at the top and it'll say recovery booting and then you'll get the little Android guy saying installing system update. Once this finishes doing its thing, it'll boot you into the recovery mode. Let that do its thing, it'll take a little while and then you'll get some options up here at the top. So you see we've got some options here and kind of hard to see once it's selected, but you're gonna wanna go down to wipe data factory reset. Use the volume keys, the touchscreen is disabled basically right now. And so once you get to wipe data, which is after apply update from SD card and before wipe cache partition. So go there and then hit the power button and it's going to ask you yes or no. So go ahead and select yes and then hit the power button again. And so it's going to do its thing and switch to the bottom here. It says data wipe complete, set factory reset done. So that formatted the data and cache partitions and once we select up here at the top, we're gonna to go to reboot system now, which is the first option, and then hit the power key, and it should reboot the phone into its original state from when we first powered it on out of the box. Okay, so the phone is booted up and now it says it's installing applications. So this is like really reinitializing the phone, and so this is gonna take a little while, but like I said, this is something you definitely want to do to get rid of any personal data that might be on the phone. So we're back at the beginning. It's been wiped and it is now cleared of all your data. So you can go ahead and feel a little more comfortable with returning it to the store and not worrying about your stuff being on the phone. So hopefully y'all find this useful if you're returning your Note 7s, which you definitely should be returning it, you know, because uh, safety first. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this in the future, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions for me, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, and Instagram, or send me a message through my homepage or here on YouTube, or just drop a comment in the comment section down below. Until next time, take care.